Lego, 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 Lego. Come on, coach. Hey, we got. Hey, first off, what is good, a team? It's your boy T back at it with another reaction, coach. Now, uh, J. Cole obviously dropped off the off season today. We just dropped the reaction. Not even a full hour, but well, it might be more than a, a hour by the time y'all seeing this. But if y'all haven't seen the reaction, a link will be up there. That was literally a full hour reaction. You feel me? Um, but we checked out every track in there. Time stamps are in the description. Uh, my favorite track off this so far got to be Pride is the Devil, bro, with a uh, little baby on it. That one goes crazy to me. That's why we got the instrumental riding in the background. That money is tough. You feel me? But um, RDC World 1. These niggas didn't dropped off a damn skit. It's like three minutes long. I almost forgot that they dropped it, but I haven't seen any of it yet. Um, it's called, it says, How J. Cole fans were after they heard J. Cole's new album, The Off Season, one time. <laughs> I feel like this is about to be pure time foolery, bruh. Pure time foolery. Y'all know we we uh, dropped that Jermaine. Jermaine Cole? Like, we, we, <laughs> we dropped a little snippet of that in the reaction to the... Uh, to the freestyle he did um on la leakers if y'all haven't seen that a link will be up there bruh but either way this almost had 500 000 views i think it dropped at midnight is well no no it dropped eight hours ago so it dropped earlier this morning but let me go ahead and get y'all right we're gonna check this out coach this should be pure comedy yo. these niggas be so quick with it bruh that's why i can't wait the bag on nba playoffs about to start your boy's a lebron fan so y'all know who i'm going for but I know they're gonna be dropping uh, skits and stuff from the from the playoffs, so this should be RDC is about to heat up, basically. You feel me? Every day. Let's see what the hell is talking I... about. <clears throat> Hold on, Bill. Let me make sure y'all right. All right, we all good. I don't know. I just feel like we can maybe stop world hunger. <laughs> find ways to stop killing. What? You know that new J. Cole just dropped, right? <laughs> Duh, nigga. Anyway, we can find ways to stop world. No, I'm just saying, how'd you like it? What you mean, how'd I love it, nigga? What are you talking <laughs> about? It's a classic. <laughs> it's a classic? How's it a classic? Hold on, what's your. <laughs> it's a classic. Nigga heard it one time, said it's a classic. What y'all think, though, bro? Because for me, I actually ranked J. Cole's album in the full album reaction we did to the off season. I, I I ranked all his albums somewhere in there. But for me, before this one dropped, it was between 2014 Forest Hills Drive and Born Center. Those two were teetering for one and two for me. Sideline story was a dope one, but I don't think that was like Cole when he was in his like he was like climbing to his prime at that point on, on, on that first album. You feel me? Um, but that one still has some like some like dope ones on there. Uh, what's the Four Your Eyes Only? That one's probably one of his worst albums in my opinion, bro. There's only ten tracks on there, but he he has some vibes on there. But that one was probably one of my least favorite albums by Cole. And then I believe it was K.O.D. after that. So I can safely put Forest Hills Drive and. Born Center as a classic in my eyes. KOD, I mean, he had some on there, but it was, it was, I don't know. You feel me? I like Forest Hill Drive and Born Center more than KOD. Four Guys Only, like I said, that's like the bottom, in my opinion. Sideline Story is somewhere jumbled up in there. You feel me? And what he did on here, I would say I got about seven to maybe eight out of the 12 tracks that I vibe with. You feel me? Really about seven. To me, what I call it a classic, I mean, I only heard it one time all the way through. I can't necessarily say it's a classic off first listen. I'm going to have to, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to have to sit with it a little bit. But it still got some, like, dope vibes on it. But y'all let me know. Matter of fact, rank y'all top, rank the top five Cole albums, one to five. Y'all, y'all, y'all let me know in the comments. I'm doing a little bit too much talking, though. Let's, let's get back to the skit, coach. Motherfucker said a classic, though. What? A classic? How's it a classic? It just came out. <laughs> yeah. What? Yeah, this nigga stupid. <laughs> look at his, look at his face though, bro. These niggas are fools, man. No. <laughs> what? Yeah, this nigga stupid. What are you talking about? Did you J Cole? <laughs> Jermaine. Yes. Jermaine. Cole. Yes. 
You talking about the one that just said, I could put an M on your head, now you Luigi, brother? Him? That was tough, though. I did like that bar. I did like that bar. Y yes, him. Him. The real is back. The veil is back. Flow Bananas here. South on the off season, J. Cole. Yes. <laughs> Friday Night Lights? J yes. Okay, yeah. What are you talking about? Look at this nigga. He ain't never dressed like this a day in his life. Look at this nigga. He got his life together. <laughs> I got my life together. No, you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Not with that fit on, you know. Like, them khakis are a little too loose. <laughs> oh, weak, bro. These niggas are fools. Pure clown. What are you talking about? That's how it's a classic. Nigga got niggas really thinking and moving, nigga. That's how it's a classic. You must be one of them trolls, huh? <laughs> yeah, he troll. He a troll. You one of them J. Cole boring. J. Cole too old. I mean, yes, the nigga is 36, but so is LeBron, and he's still hooping. He's still the best player. <laughs> yeah, that's that's a fact, though. I know it's a lot of people want to say KD and this and that. That's a fact. LeBron is the best player, my nigga. Stop the madness. Hold on, no. Hold on, no. Let's keep it going. Ain't Drake like 34? Yeah. yeah. About to win. All Hold on. The Cole is actually 36, though? J. Cole age. This nigga really 36. That's tough. I thought he was like early, early 30s. He four years off of, uh, off of 40, man. That's tough. A decade. Maybe the older niggas are just better than the young niggas. I don't know. But I know I'm tired of these rappers saying, look, all my niggas shoot like Stan. Like, is that a bar? <laughs> I, I guess. It. I mean, how many times? But it has been hella people who they, who they use that, though. That's not even a joke. I know who said, I guess. I guess. I mean, how many times have they said that shit? Look, you can go, nigga, because this nigga finna make me bad. He is one of them trolls for sure. But look, don't be coming over here questioning J. Cole shit, talking about, oh, well, how is it a classic? It just came out. Nigga, listen to it. <laughs> then go to sleep, wake up, listen to it again, nigga. It's a classic. I ain't gonna say it again. It's a classic. I'm not a classic. Look, I don't know what else you talking about. But go listen to that one more time. All 12 songs. Look, Hunger on the Hillside. 95 South. Come on now. Stop playing. Now, my thing was 95 South to me was just okay. You feel me? I liked it as an intro, but that one wasn't like, that wasn't too, too crazy to me. Hunger on Hillside, though, I did. I did like that one. And how, how a little baby came on there sliding? That was tough. Pride 21 was the devil. Savage came on there sliding. Can 21 Savage even slot like... How is he sliding on J. Cole level like that? Is that a new duo or something? <laughs> Dynamic uh, duo, bitch. I don't know. I, me either. That, that's, that's why I don't know either. <laughs> little baby slide. Hey, come on, but look. Hey, look. My life together. I ain't got no time to argue with y'all. I already know how niggas be on the internet. Young boy better than me. Here's to the rock. Young hey, boy? Hey, young boy? Who said that? Well, well actually, that some, of these, some of these younger... The younger generation might actually say that. Young boy is better than Cole. You're off cocaine if you thought that, my nigga. I mean, young boy does his thing, but he's not, that's not, that's not J. Cole, my nigga. Stop the madness. But these niggas are clowns, bro. That was RDC World's one, RDC World 1's new skit. How J. Cole fans were after hearing the offseason one time. That's tough. <laughs> these niggas are fools. A classic, though, y'all, y'all let me know what y'all think about that. Do y'all think this is a classic? It be a drop to date, my nigga. I mean, I don't know if you can really call it a classic in one day of listening to it. I don't know about that, but it is what it is, bro. We did hear Cole is supposed to be supposedly dropping off two more albums. Got one called It's a Boy, and then the last one, The Fall Off. And that might be his retirement after The Fall Off. Um, now, I don't know if he's dropping those this year or how that's going, but definitely ready for those as well. But I like what he did with this, bro. I'm ready to sit with this. Listen to it, kind of put it in rotation a little bit and just see 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 how these tracks live from like month like like months from now, you feel me? But like I said, bro, if y'all ain't seen the album reaction, be sure to go check it out. I wonder if he gonna drop visuals off for any of these tracks, you feel me? But either way, bro. Y'all get down there in the comments. Let me know what y'all thought about the damn skit. These niggas are fools. Like I said, the playoffs are starting soon. We definitely going to be coming with reactions to the games. But I know RDC World 1 is going to be dropping those skits off. Like how LeBron was after the loss or after winning. You feel me? So those should those are going to be pure comedy. So I'll definitely be waiting on those. Um, but hey, bro. We on the road to 20K subscribers, 18. I appreciate all the love y'all been showing so far. Let's keep it going. Keep it growing. 
And like always, say y'all keep coming back, tuning in. I'm going to keep these videos rolling out. We're going to keep getting it lit over here. Catch y'all on the next video.